at Hustler, we believe in innovation, not imitation. Now, our applicator range of sprays has now been proved for over 10 years, and that is because we put our homework into the design. So when you're choosing a sprayer, make sure you don't sh shortchange yourself, because with applicator, there is very few things that we have needed to update in the last 10 years due to farmer feedback. The key things we have updated is added the Ergomax induction system, which allows you to operate the entire sprayer from the ground instead of climbing onto the machine. One of the key, key things that farmers have asked for and we've done other very minor changes. That's because we've done our homework we built a sprayer that is fit for task that the farmer wants to do. When it comes to tank sizes, flushing tank sizes, wash tank sizes, toolboxes, pump sizes, boom, design and suspension, wing lift, nothing on the market has ever caught up to the applicator spray range. And it's still today the leading sprayer in the game because of that innovation that Hustler put in back in 2013. Number one thing that you need to look for when you're choosing the boom sprayer is boom stability, how well it tracks as you're running across the ground for two reasons. One is the consistency of the application that is on your crop. And the second reason is for the durability and longevity of how long that boom is going to last in your spraying conditions. Now watch this. Assuming you drop that back wheel of your tractor into a hole, suspension on this boom will pull your gear section down, let go, and just look at how smooth that supple that suspension is. That makes for an unbeatable boom when it comes to application consistency and longevity. That's why we give it a five-year warranty. These rubbers here, unique on the Hustler Eagle Tech boom, gives this boom your suspension. So watch this. Notice the track is sitting perfectly still and the boom is able to do this. What that does, when you're screwing around on headlands, with your tractor, that's taking all the stress and the forward and rearward motion out of the boom through these rubbers here. When selecting a boom, one of the key things that you don't want in your operation is the hassle of cleaning nozzle filters all the time. It's downtime, it's wasted time that you could be spraying. So in the Hustler boom, we have these inline section filters here so this section filter, nice and easy to clean out. Flush that out, put it back in, screw it back in. And instead of having to replace 27 nozzle filters, you've just got three of those, one per section. The filter's cleaned, out spraying again, job done. Very fast and very effective. Nozzle bodies. So on the Eagle Tech, we're running triple nozzle bodies. So you can have three different nozzle sizes with different application rates. And you can simply select the, the new nozzle size for whatever spraying rate you're doing. Or you can switch it off for band spraying. Make sure your sprayer has this function because it will save you time and money with your spraying. So our Eagle Tech boom has three-dimensional suspension. So you have the vertical mast suspension with a spring up the top, which allows the whole boom to bounce like this. It has these springs here, which allow your end sections to suspend like this. It has your suspension like this, which takes the load out of vertical forward and rearward motion. And you've also got self-leveling suspension, so the trapeze in here allows the boom to self-level to the angle that the tank is sitting on. You've also got these hydro adapters, so 
through them across the bone, the intersections and the centre section, which just keep it moving super, super smooth. So on our Eagle Tech booms, when you're following across contours, you want to be able to move your boom arms individually to follow the contour of the ground. With Eagle Tech, our wing lift is individual, either side, and it's from the tractor that your wing is lifting. So you can lift that up and over fences. If you want to swing around over fences, just tip it up. Or if you're following through a grip, following through some undulating terrain, you can just follow the contour. It's nice and easy with, with our wing lift. So that's unique to this custom design, and it's a game changer when it comes to contour following and ease of operation for the operator. Another point to note when choosing a sprayer is just how compact the whole unit is. So that keeps the centre of gravity nice and close to the tractor. So when you're operating on steep hill country, you don't have a huge um, load centre out the back, causing light front end on the tractor. So what you'll notice is the whole boom is very, very compact on the Hustler sprayer. You'll also notice that the back nozzles are protected. Should you back up into the, into the corner of the paddock and you back into the fence, all your nozzles and your vital parts are protected from damage. You'll also notice all our nozzles are also protected from damage should a boom hit the ground. So that basically means that it's eliminating downtime because a busted nozzle body means your spraying day is over unless you have another on hand. On top of our really compact design, one of the key things that farmers were asking for when we developed the Abigail spray range is good access into pitching your sprayer to the tractor. That's what we've got from a nice tapered side on our sprayer. And it gives you very good access to change your mixing rate and also activate your hopper. Filling. Filling is all done from ground level. There's no need to climb up onto the Hustler sprayer when you're filling. Everything can be done from ground. You can pump through here to fill the tank, or you can use the sprayer pump to suck through there and fill the tank. So simply connect your hose and start filling. All your mixing and chemical induction is done through our awesome Ergomax hopper here. So 23 litres, you can put all your chemicals and powders into there. You've got three functions on, on the Ergo Mix here for sluicing out and rinsing your chemical containers and also for stirring up any um, powder for uh, products that you want to put into your sprayer. So that's all nicely done from ground level. There's no need to climb up on top of a hustle sprayer. It's been designed to work from ground level because there's nothing more dangerous than carrying chemical containers onto a sprayer. You also have down here, you have nice easy to use tap, which selects your flush tank over the other side. So that's 100 litres of flushing water that you're carrying on board with, this, with the Hustler sprayer. So that's more than adequate to flush out any chemicals throughout the sprayer. And just check the capacities of Hustler when you're comparing Hustler to other sprayers. So 23 litre hand washing tank, 100 litre flushing tank, biggest pump on the industry in this category. So make sure you don't shortchange yourself with the spec of your sprayer. Another important note to check when you're buying a boom sprayer is that when the boom is in transport position, that the boom is held securely. You'll notice here, there's a hook arrangement which takes all the load of the outer section off the boom pivot pins. So as you bounce it down a laneway, that's not flogging out your boom pivots. So the weight is kept in and nothing's just wrecking, wrecking the boom as travelling between jobs. Make sure you check that when you're looking for a spray. Calculating your application rate can be really, really simple. So what we've done is we've moulded into the tank a nozzle chart, which is a permanent graphic, and you simply check your speed, your application rate you want to, want to run it, and it gives you the pressure to spray it. Really simple, and it's always with you, not having to fluff through papers and books and things in the cab trying to look for that rate, it's always with your sprayer. When you're operating your sprayer, 
from the cab you want to be able to see everything that's happening out there. So what we have done with the applicator range is we've put all the valving on the front of the machine. So you can see your pressure gauge, you can see your valves, you can see your calibrated return, you can see the tank level which is very easy to see because it's a straight um, level tube with your gratings on it and that's very easy to see so we haven't put valves all over the machine it's right in a nice view so it can keep your spraying spraying operation very very simple along with individual wing lift which is on your tractor remotes individually you can lift lift the left side or down and lift the right side or down and same with the center mast so very very simple because when you're operating a sprayer it needs to be straightforward and easy to use. When it comes to pumps, we've used the premium quality Comet brand, it's world renowned and it's very easy to get parts from in any country of the world. So we've chosen the best brand of pumps, we've also mounted that pump right at the back of the chassis, it means we have an extra long PDO shaft, so that means you're not having to chop the shaft or have separate shafts depending on the size of the tractor, the shaft will always work and it means that you can run the sprayer at any height of the linkage because the angles of the video shaft are, are not too steep. So we've also offset it onto this side of the sprayer so the reason for that is it gives us a very deep sump in the tank meaning that even when you're spraying on very steep um, terrain with your tractor, it's never going to suck air into the system and blow out. Um, so it's got the best sump pickup out of any other sprayer in its class. Our agitation system is very, very unique with Hustler. We call it Mix Max, which is a trademarked um, agitation system. What it does is with this tap here, you can infinitely vary how much agitation you want in the tank from a sparkle type agitation system which is excellent for liquid fertilizers or um, powder products where it's hard to keep product in suspense right down to switching it almost to zero so that there's no splashing in the tank because when there's no splashing in the tank if you're spraying glyphosates or roundup type products where they're very foamy by being able to switch the agitation right down, it prevents you creating a tank load of foam, which is not much help for when you're trying to spray out a paddock. So our chassis design, it's all fully robot welded, so consistency is, is guaranteed. Our design is a straight through chassis design, so three point linkage tractor mount is here, boom mount is the other side, the chassis runs straight through the middle, instead of around the tank because what happens is when you have a chassis that wraps around the tank as the load comes on you've got this motion like this and it's flex in the tank and because our chassis goes through the middle we've also been able to eliminate any internal thinness on the inside of the tank which is weak spots uh, causing your tanks to fail and it's also places for powdery flight uh, products to settle out on when you've got flat spots. So we've eliminated the flat spots, we've created a, a very strong chassis that runs straight through the middle to the boom, 